All right, today I'm going to show you how to build a pyrogen igniter for a rocket. Uh, I, I use them for sugar rockets. Um, what you start with is uh, two small gauge pieces of copper wire. I use uh, the wires that are inside of a Cat5 or Ethernet cable. Uh, I've stripped about a half inch off the ends. The color doesn't really matter. <clears throat> and then you take uh, steel wool you can get at Walmart or pretty much anywhere. Uh, it can't be the really fine stuff. Um, I, I prefer to use the rather coarse steel wool. Take off about an inch and a half or so with a pair of dykes and then take a piece of wire and take your steel wool and you wrap it about three four times around the wire and you fold this over on where you just wrapped on the wire then you take pliers I prefer needle nose and you crush that right there trying to keep the wire as straight as possible and you grab your other piece of wire and you wrap that oh how many ever times it takes to get about a half oh, that's too close how, how many ever times it takes to get about a half an inch away from the other wire and then you fold that fold that one over And you see you have a piece of wire with uh, some ends tied off. And then you take your dikes again and you cut the wire as close, or not, or not the wire, but the steel wool. You cut it as close to the wire as you can on both sides just so you don't have any extra hang hanging off. And then you take and you straighten them out as much as you can. Kind of line them up. Then you want to put one lower than the other one and just twist the steel wool around the wire. And then you want to just kind of straighten them out. If your wire ends are too too long, you can cut them off because obviously you don't want the copper ends to be touching. And then right below that, you grab them and give them a good twist four or five times just so they stay together and straighten them out if you need to. And then what I have here is some pyrogen that I've that I've pre-made. Um, pretty much what that is is you take ping pong balls, which are nitrocellulose, and you you dissolve them in acetone overnight, and then add twice the amount of volume in black powder, and you stir it and allow that to set for a few hours and then you dip the ends of this in what pretty much is just black powder glue uh, this pyrogen here is pretty thick because it's it's been open for, for a while and then you just let that dry and when you are ready to use it you jam the end of this into your rocket up into your core and attach an electrical igniter right on the ends, which, uh, I'll, which I'll explain how, how to make in the future. That's all. Have a good one.